What's DOCP? XMP, DOCP in BIOS. XMP stands for Extreme Memory Profile. It is a technology developed by Intel that allows users to easily overclock their memory modules. XMP profiles are pre-configured settings that can be loaded into the BIOS, which will automatically overclock the memory to its rated speed and timings. DOCP stands for Direct Overclock Profile. It is a similar technology developed by AMD that works in the same way as XMP. DOCP stands for Extended Overclock Profiles. It is a proprietary technology developed by Gigabyte that works in a similar way to XMP and DOCP. The main difference between XMP, DOCP, and EOCP is that they are all developed by different companies. This means that they are not always compatible with each other. For example, if you have an Intel motherboard and you try to use a memory module with an AMD DOCP profile, it will not work. In general, XMP is the most widely supported technology. If you are not sure which technology to use, it is best to use XMP. Here is a table that summarizes the differences between XMP, DOCP, and EOCP. Is it safe to use XMP, DOCP, or EOCP? Yes, it is safe to use XMP, DOCP, or EOCP. These technologies are designed to be safe and stable. However, it is important to note that overclocking your memory can increase the risk of instability. If you experience any problems after enabling XMP, DOCP, or EOCP, you can disable them in the BIOS. How do I enable XMP, DOCP, or EOCP? To enable XMP, DOCP, or EOCP, you will need to enter the BIOS. The exact steps for entering the BIOS will vary depending on your motherboard. Once you are in the BIOS, look for a setting called XMP, DOCP, or EOCP. Set this setting to enable. Save your changes and exit the BIOS. What if my motherboard does not have XMP, DOCP, or EOCP? If your motherboard does not have XMP, DOCP, or EOCP, you will need to manually overclock your memory. This can be a more difficult process, and it is not recommended for beginners. If you are not comfortable overclocking your memory, you can leave it at its default settings. 